Hello guys, value for welcome back to another video. I promised I was gonna do a part two decoding the mass rituals which took place at the Astro World concert in Houston, Texas by Travis Scott. There's no room for error on this one, and I like you guys to be open minded. Like I said, the concert was a ritual. Keeping aside all these arts and symbolisms, keeping them aside, the concert itself was a ritual. Now let's start decoding the whole stuff. Take a look at Travis Scott, the main artist. Look at his shirt. Look very carefully. If you spiritual, if you walk, you see that on one side we got royal people falling down. It might be drawn like cartoons, but it still has a spiritual impact because it's just symbolism being exposed. And that's why I want you guys to be open-minded. You know, if you look at the this part, we got blow people, you know, falling down. And when they fall down, I think um, you already know, like blue is a very good symbolism. It's a, it's a much better symbolism than red. It's like when these guys are falling down, they enter a different portal. And when they enter that portal, they become demonic, they become red. And red is a symbol for blood sacrifice. And you can make that one up. Red is a very demonic symbolism. And you can see Red Devil with horns. In fact, in fact, it was always right in front of everyone's eyes. This thing is satanic. If you've learned something new, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and please share this video. So the people who died in that concert is is pretty much the same stuff because Travis Scott already explained every single thing on his shirt. You know, when you fall down, I mean when you get possessed by the beats, by the music, and you and you know you you get into a rage and you and when you fall down and you die you become a sacrifice like you go to the other side like, like see you on the other side the other side is astral world and like i said the astral world is full of demons it's full of all kinds of evil things i don't want to take you guys deep into the astral world but believe me the astral world is real okay like i said we live in a vr world okay we live in a virtual reality world our true self is our souls. I mean, if you get sweet with all these earthly vanities, believe me, you're going to regret it. Because this is just an experience, okay? This is just an, a physical experience, but we have another spiritual experience. The vast majority of our life will be living in the spiritual form. So it's kind of like, yeah, like we're blessed by God to have this physical experience. So we shouldn't joke with it. If you get deceived by the devil, and you're so sweet with the earthly world, with the pleasures, with the fun, with the games, forgetting about your true self, your soul. Believe me, <laughs> you'll just be used as a pawn. Like you've been an easy victim for the devil to pawn around. These portals are actually like crossroads. I mean, they are real. And when people open these portals, I mean, because artists, they do open these portals, he actually give room for demons to come into the platform and do their things so whatever happened like how how on earth can a crowd search kill eight people come on guys like that is demonic because like i've never i've, I've never seen this before remember that jesus christ died for our sins he actually gave up his blood he gave up his blood to clean us from this mess so we won't actually need to do blood rituals in order to to attain a certain level in this life but as you can see, people choose to flow with Satan. They choose to reject God. And when you reject God, what else do you expect? And you want to go far in life, you have to sell your soul to the devil and do blood rituals. And it's very evil. People still reject the Savior. They sell their souls and satisfy themselves with earthly pleasures. Forgetting about the abundance. The, the abundance that is waiting for them in the heavens. That's why I cringe when I see these kids falling cheaply for the loss of the flesh. For these earthly things anyways you can call it a lesson but be very careful your soul is eternal okay and if you miss your road to heaven if you double around you found the wrong path then believe me <laughs> the punishment is going to be so hard anyways thank you guys for watching make sure you stay tuned for the part three see you guys in another video bye